the internet and welcome or welcome back to my channel I thought I would start off this vlog with a bit of a life update because I don't know like I've been in university for already like three weeks but it honestly it has felt like three months these past couple of weeks have just been like really busy and also just like full of change so it's just been a lot and I feel like I haven't really had the time to catch my breath and actually like catch up with you guys it's currently Friday I just had a very intense and like busy week. I just feel like I had a lot going on this week with school, also with some YouTube stuff and overall just trying to like stay balanced in terms of all of that and still like try to put myself first and try to hang out with friends. It honestly just feels like I have to like switch gears in my brain whenever I'm doing like another task. So like when I'm switching from an assignment to another or a class to another and I don't know, I think going into university, I was like very excited and don't get me wrong, I really love what I'm studying and my classes are great, my classmates are all very friendly, but like you can't deny that it is a big change still and I think I was expecting to kind of like get settled into it more quickly and that just hasn't really been the case, like I feel like I'm still adapting. But yeah, like I said, I just had like a very busy week. My sleep schedule was definitely off and today's Friday. Usually I do have a lecture, um, but it is recorded so I can just like watch it back. And to be honest, that class has like hundreds of students, so they're not going to miss me. And I just figured it would be better for me to just stay at home and kind of try to slow down and catch up on some work and do a little bit of self-care. I've got my matcha, so that means it's time to be productive. I'm really looking forward to just like sitting down with my planner and my notion open and just like getting organized because like I said, I've just felt like I was like juggling so much this week that I haven't really had time to really see where I'm at in terms of assignments and like goals and all of that. So we're going to take some time to do that and yeah, let's get to it. We've got our matcha for energy, of course, and then a lot of water because I have definitely not been hydrating enough so I'm trying to fix that I've gotten a couple of questions about where my laptop case is from and it is actually from the brand Moft it was gifted to me but I genuinely really do recommend this it protects my laptop perfectly and is very very like thin and compact and I also like honestly use it as a just like little desk mat and yeah it also doubles as a laptop stand so it's honestly perfect to take on the go
writing out like my entire to-do list for this weekend and not gonna lie looking at it it is a lot but I feel like I can see things a lot clearer now that I've just written down every single thing that I want to get done and obviously if I don't get it all done this weekend which I probably won't I'll still feel fine I think at least just having it all written down helps me because I just don't want to forget anything and the to-do list template that I have like on my notion includes both tasks for university YouTube work and also like a personal section so down there I've just written down some plans that I have this weekend and also like I want to do some cleaning and some journaling this weekend but yeah I feel a lot better now that I have everything written down in front of me and I'm gonna start looking at what I can get done today so yeah like forum post kind of blog thing that I had to do for my film analysis class and now I'm gonna watch the lecture that I did not attend today and take some notes. Great thing about watching lectures remotely is also that you can watch them in two times speed so there's another advantage. <laughs> It is Saturday. It's already 10.30 because I kind of let myself sleep in a little bit this morning, but I have my apron on because I want to make some pancakes. I figured that would be a good way to start the weekend and I can just prepare some batter and then have it tomorrow as well. So I'm going to get to making that. But yeah, the plan for today is just to try to get ahead on like readings and assignments for this week, just because I really want to make sure I'm prepared and not overwhelmed. This evening, I maybe want to do like a cozy fall movie night. I feel like that would be really fun. And yeah, we'll see if I actually get to do that. But yeah, I'm gonna put on some music and get to baking.
Good morning and happy Sunday everyone. I've just been doing some journaling and I'm really trying to get back into it because honestly ever since university started I have not been journaling consistently whatsoever. I think I've just gotten pretty overwhelmed and I'm trying to force myself to get back into it because I know that it just like provides me kind of an opportunity to check in with myself and that's like really necessary during busy times even though taking the time to journal might feel like a chore so I got a new journal and I just started writing in it and also setting some like goals and intentions for the week so I think that's gonna be super helpful later this afternoon I also want to check out this like local autumn market in Montreal so I'm really excited to go check that out with my sister later and I think it's gonna be really fun and like aesthetic and kind of wholesome autumn vibes so I think that's like a perfect Sunday activity but before that I'd like to obviously get some work done so yeah that's what I'm gonna get started on right after I finish planning out my week <laughs> that I was at and I thought I would do a little bit of a haul of everything that I got. If you're interested and you're in the Montreal area, it's called the Montreal Makers Market, I believe, and I found them on Instagram. I believe that they do this every month, um, but again, you can go check out their page for like more information, but it was really cool and there were a lot of different like stores. I think it's the perfect kind of place if you're looking for like small gifts because there were a lot of like jewelry, um, candles, knit stuff, like kind of just like handmade things and I think that's really special. So yeah, anyways, let's get into a haul of what I got. First thing I got is actually this bracelet that I'm wearing. When I saw this one, I really liked it. My friend Melina has like a very similar one and I always compliment her on it. I also really like the colors and I feel like they go with a lot of things. So. I got that and then my friend Charlotte's birthday is also coming up this week so I just got her this cute card it just says happy birthday in French and it has this cat coming out of a cake next I got some soaps I got this one and then this one oh my god it smells so good and sweet it literally just smells like a bar of chocolate and I love it and it has little like gold specks on the top I also, this is like a really small thing, but I got myself this butterfly sticker to put on my planner because I want to start like decorating it with cute stickers and make it more like personalized. And then last but not least, I got myself these little scrunchies. They were 3 for 12 and I've honestly been meaning to get little hair ties like this because I just think they're so cute and they kind of like elevate your outfit, but very simple. And I love the colors that I got. Again, I'll have like the information in the description or like on screen if you're interested. But for now, I'm just gonna drink my tea and do some more work. So I think I'm gonna end today's video here. I really hope that you enjoyed. I really had a nice time bringing you along with me on this weekend. I feel like it was a pretty successful past couple of days. I was fairly productive. I honestly feel pretty prepared for this week. But at the same time, I feel like I got to do 
some fun things and relax and i'm really glad that you chose to hang out with me thank you so much hope you had a nice time too i still to be honest feel a little bit nervous about starting this week i think that's not gonna go away entirely but you know i'm feeling better and feeling slightly more prepared and i feel like i have a better mindset thank you so much for hanging out with me i hope you have a lovely week we've got this and yeah i will talk to you guys in my next video bye